Leading into the long weekend, today's ceremony was meant to begin the closure process for members of the Maine Maritime community. Fire. This ceremony is meant to mark the end of the watch for the officers and crew of El Faro. Five of the 33 missing mariners walked these grounds as students. Michael Davidson, class of 1988. Danielle Randolph, class of 2005. Mitchell Kuflick, class of 2011. Michael Holland, class of 2012. Dylan Mecklin, class of 2014. Many in this close-knit community have ties to the missing. Captain Nathan Gandy knew Michael Holland and Dylan Mecklin and says the young men epitomized the type of students who make Maine Maritime what it is. Always willing to lend a helping hand, always looking to help the underclassmen as they were, were uh, you know, getting caught up in their studies. Uh, just a, a couple of great guys. Uh, very representative, I think, of what I've got for a student body here. A Maine Maritime spokeswoman says right now the academy is working on upgrades to the plaque on campus that memorializes graduates who have been lost at sea. Once those upgrades are finished, Maine Maritime will add the names of the five graduates who were aboard El Faro. In Castine, Paul Merrill, WMTW News 8.